Okay, I just wanted to update everybody. I'm sure they're all just dying to know. Anyway, I uh, put the Benchtop Precision belt drive on my uh, G0704. Uh, I just burn up the stock motor. I had a Weiss 1100 water laying in the weight, and uh, since I lost my mill, well, I was having a little hard time trying to make the parts that I needed, so I just bought it from Scott and uh great project he uh i mean i would do some changes if it was mine but hey wouldn't we all it's a uh it's very nicely done beautiful finishes you may see it i relocated my an additional east stop there in the front gutted this took all that stuff out relocated my box off the side of the head mounted it to the column itself retained the tack m hackney had a had a great uh tutorial basically on how to uh, reuse that tack and use a wall wart instead of the internal power supply uh, I had fried it somehow anyway so I got to retain that here's an example of how it works and uh, so with this belt drive let's see my lowest which of course this is in high gear uh, well, high pulley, no more gears. Uh, 375, though, that's not workable. And then, uh, let's see where we go. 5,200, 5,300 RPM. And, uh, very quiet. The splines fit the carrier very well. Uh, and also what I did is I linked this in with the original switch. And so when I hit this, it kills a spindle and it kills mock it didn't do that before and it's not being done through a relay it's being done well it's got a magnetic contactor in the safety switch and i just have two different sets of contacts in my e-stop and uh that's how it works but anyway just wanted to let you know what uh scott's product looked like and uh i think he did a fine job he's uh beautiful machining I would like to change a few things again, like I said, but they're really insignificant, and I can't wait to do my first cuts. I haven't done anything with it, but it seems a lot smoother. Obviously, I probably picked up a, at least a thousand RPM. Nice little cover, uh, which I thought was the spindle lock at first. I was like, "What a cheesy spindle lock!" Makes a much more functional cover bracket than a spindle lock. Anyway, enough bitching, and uh, time to cut something here pretty soon. See ya.